Hello and welcome to this guided meditation with me, Nikki Allen. Please do not listen to this if you are driving or operating machinery. Since birth I have enjoyed the beauty, the love, the comfort and the guidance of the spirit world and the angel realms. And since then it has been my absolute passion in life to try and bring their love, their presence and the afterlife to all of you beautiful people. There is nothing on this earth that allows you to feel more love, comfort, courage and the fact that you're not alone by experiencing phenomena from the spirit world and the angel realms. I've spent many, many a time witnessing their presence, witnessing the miracles that they bring. And so I really did want to strive to be able to raise my frequency, to be able to experience more from them. And inadvertently, I found myself able, by bringing my vibrations higher and higher, to actually go up to the reality layer. A layer in heaven where all of our loved ones and our pets reside and continue to live on. And so you can imagine that my next passion was to be able to help you to raise your vibration, to allow you to be taken to this wonderful place. It really can be quite difficult sometimes if you have problems with mind focus to get up to this place. But all I can say is continually play this and allow me to take you on this journey. And eventually I believe that you will succeed and you will be able to go up and visit your loved ones, visit the angel realms whenever you wish. Wouldn't that be something? So why not give it a try? The most important thing is, is that you have to be relaxed. You have to make sure that you are completely, completely able to trust me and my voice to take you to this place. What I will say though, is that this is a very highly emotive meditation. If you find that you haven't grieved your loved one, then perhaps it may be better for you not to participate in this particular guided meditation and perhaps seek help elsewhere, whether it be a GP or a counsellor. There is nothing more painful than losing a loved one or a pet. And so I'm trying to help bridge the gap between the complete loss, the chaos and the pain that ensues as soon as you realise that you physically will not see your loved one again. So this is my little input into trying to help you, after you've grieved, to enjoy and embrace a new relationship with your loved ones. Yes, it's very different, for they're in spirit form, but once you make this magical connection, you will find that you will see signs, synchronicity, and miracles that most people won't believe if you tell them what you've experienced. And wouldn't that be a wonderful thing as well? So it just leads me to say, I wish you every strength. I wish you so much love. And I really do hope that you get some wonderful results from my meditation today. What I ask is that you now find somewhere to relax. Either sitting comfortably or laying down. Please don't worry if you fall asleep. Your subconscious mind will also take on board what I'm saying. For the best tips, for the best experience in my meditations, please see my other video on my channel, which will give you lots of tips and lots of advice to get the very best out of this experience. Make sure that you're not going to be disturbed. Turn your phone off. Perhaps have a glass of water ready for after your meditation. And be aware, as I just about take you into this little journey that you may see people that have passed over. So now you're sitting in this wonderfully relaxed space with no disturbances. Hopefully you're in comfortable clothing and you're feeling very, very much at peace. Allow yourself now to take a deep breath in. 
hold and release. Take a deep breath in, hold, release. Another deep breath in, hold and release. With each breath that comes in and then with the breath that goes out you're feeling more relaxed, you're feeling more at peace. There is nothing in your mind apart from you thinking of your breath slowly going in, slowly going out, my voice and the angel music in the background. Slow your breathing down at your own pace, being aware of that breath coming in and releasing, releasing the thoughts of the day, the worries of the day, anything that's been on your mind is now totally irrelevant. You are not now in a space where you have to worry about anything. You are purely here to relax and listen to my voice and allow me to take you forward on this beautiful journey. And as you continually take in these slow, beautiful, deeper breaths, imagine yourself sitting on a bank and this is a grass bank and in front of you is a beautiful sparkling river clear crystalline water is glittering past you it's a beautiful sunny day you can feel the warmth on your shoulders and the top of your head you can feel a breeze just gently blowing past you and you're feeling amazing you decide to dangle your legs down and dip your toes into the cool water and you watch your toes go deeper into the water until they're up to your ankles those waves just lapping very slightly around your ankles the cool feeling of this water is sublime you place your face up to the sun and feel this beautiful warm so relaxed, so at peace. You're aware that this water is slowly circling around your feet and you're sitting relaxing on this grassy bank. There is nobody there, just you sitting there, relaxed, happy, warm, safe. Then look down to your feet, swirling around in this beautiful clear water and you start to notice that there is a beautiful blue silver colour just going around past your feet swirling around between your toes swirling around over your feet and under the soles of your feet you then start to see this beautiful blue silver colour start to slowly twist up around your ankles and as you see this colour rise up past your ankles, you feel that your feet, your toes, your ankles feel completely relaxed. You then see this blue almost creating a mist around your legs with these wonderful silver heels wandering through the blue colour. Flashes of silver flashing through the blue and that blue colour now rising up past your calf muscles, up past your knees to your thighs. And again, you can feel that your legs, your calves, your thigh muscles are starting to feel deliciously heavy, relaxed, with no tension at all in any of them. This colour now rises up to your hip area, surrounding the whole bottom of your body in this beautiful blue and silver light, which is forming a mist, a mist that is curling around you. It feels beautiful, 
safe, cool. As the colour reaches your tummy, this blue and silver light almost cuddles, cradles your tummy, holds it in its energy. And as you take a breath, your tummy relaxes, allows this beautiful blue silver light to continue swirling, swirling around your midriff. And as it goes slightly higher up to your rib area, you're then aware of a pulsating right in the middle of your abdomen. It feels like the sun that's beating down on you as it pulses gold. This colour is creating a big surge in your solar plexus, allowing you to feel this energy, an energy like no other, pulsating, bringing you alive. It's almost like the beat of your heart. And the colour goes past your solar plexus with this beautiful pulsating sun-like light and reaches up to your chest. And as you breathe in and breathe out this beautiful blue coloured mist, the silver lights that are swirling within the blue infiltrate in through your body, into your lungs, allowing you to feel even more relaxed with each breath that you take in and each breath that you would exhale. The relaxation is just delicious. You can feel that this colour is now infiltrating up round your shoulders. The silver lights are creating this beautiful sense of heaviness but relaxation at the same time. The blue silver light then reaches down past both your shoulders down to your elbows, again relaxing your muscles, your limbs as it goes. The colours then are both reaching and swirling down towards your wrists, your hands, your fingers, again allowing you to feel how relaxed, calm and at peace your body is becoming, your fingers heavy, your hands relaxed. You then focus back onto your neck, your throat area, and this beautiful blue night resonates with your throat because this is the centre, the centre of you speaking your truth. Your throat chakra is now pulsating blue, meeting a vibrant, vibrant, united front with the blue colour that's surrounding itself around you. You know that after this meditation you will be able to speak your truth, anything you wish to say to anybody, anything that you wish to impart, anything you wish to say to your loved ones, you will feel stronger, you will feel more vibrant and more confident. And now you can see this beautiful blue mist with the silver shots running through it, going up through your throat making you completely unaware of when you swallow and when you don't, totally irrelevant. And this blue light wanders up to your mouth area, allowing your jaw to slacken, your tongue to rest comfortably in your mouth. And slowly it reaches up, whispers around your face, reaches your eyes, allowing your lids to feel heavier, and heavier and very slowly this blue light reaches up into the top of your crown chakra and here is a very very small opening at the top of your head and as the blue light brushes through your hair brushes past your head your scalp to this top point you feel and see in your mind this tiny, tiny hole of energy opening up, opening up. And then, slowly but surely, you can see a ray 
of purple light starting to beam from the top of your head area just like a lighthouse throwing its light across the sea you can see this big vibrant beam of light coming from the top of your head the mist then slowly goes to the back of your head and finally reaches the back of your neck and connects with all of your torso light so now your whole body is completely relaxed your mind is completely relaxed and empty only responding to my voice the music and your visualization you have been so absorbed in this wonderful blue light with these silver threads running in and out of your physical body you've realized that you're still sitting on the bank you open your eyes and look past the blue mist and realize that you are no longer by this river that you find yourself sitting in a big big fountain you're sitting on the wall and your feet are now dipped in this wonderful beautiful crystalline water you can see as you look down silver blue green gold threads running past this water this water is not of this earth in front of you in front of you you can see the fountain you can hear the water trickling down the first layer of the fountain is a huge huge clamshell and with every curve of the clamshell the water drops into the main pool where your feet are now resting the second tier up is just a smaller shell bringing water down to the lower shell which then flows down to where your feet are resting in this magnificent pool you then look at the third tier and this tier is a beautiful lotus flower open and this water is bubbling out through the middle of this lotus flower flowing out around its petals bringing peace love and balance as this translucent water flurrying with greens blue silvers golds flows down to the clamshell then down to the bigger clamshell then down into the pool where you now realize that your feet are slowly slowly swaying in by opening up this vibrant purple beam of light from above your head you have allowed your soul to travel up without any thoughts without any concerns to a completely different layer of consciousness and as you look around you still sitting on the wall still with your feet bathed in this magnificent pool you can see that you're in a garden this garden is simply beautiful to your right you can see the most vibrant of roses all different various colors in a beautifully kept rose garden and you can see as you look at the roses butterflies dragonflies busy bumblebees flying around this wonderful space you can smell a beautiful pungent smell of the roses you can hear the buzzing of the bee you can almost hear the wings that are fluttering on the butterfly everything looks cleaner brighter and more colorful what color are the roses that you see you then look around to your left and you can see the most magnificent white and silver crystal wall it's glinting in the beautiful sunshine that's still there on your shoulders warming the top of your head 
there's a beautiful warm breeze around you. At the bottom of this white silver wall is the most crisp, greenest grass. You can smell the grass. In fact, all of your senses are heightened in this magnificently coloured garden. You decide to take your feet out of the water and swing yourself around. The grass is so inviting as you step up and feel yourself melt into the deep velvety sense of comfort that you find in this lush green grass. And as you stand looking at this long white silver wall with curiosity, you almost want to follow where the wall goes. And this wonderfully turquoise green and blue dragonfly, bigger than normal dragonflies, hovers right in front of you. And for just a second, that dragonfly is looking right into your eyes. And very slowly, she turns to her left and starts to fly towards the wall and you know that you must follow this dragonfly. You walk towards this beautifully glinting white and silver wall. You place a hand up onto the wall, it's cool. You can almost feel it pulsating under your hand. It has a life and energy of its own. You take your hand away, turn yourself to your left and start to walk through this lush green grass following this dragonfly that slowly floats in front of you. The wall is to your right. You can feel the coolness of this wonderfully beautiful crystal wall. And on the left hand side you're aware still of the sun beaming down on you, bringing you warmth and comfort with a beautiful fresh warm breeze blowing through your face. This is a wonderfully safe place to be, full of beauty, full of peace and tranquility. You continue to follow the butterfly, your feet in the deep lush grass as you walk further forwards. You continue to walk along this wall and eventually you can see a break in the wall. The dragonfly stops and now you can see to your right huge silver white gates. And there was a huge stone archway full of silvers, golds and whites above these magnificent gates. This is the entrance to the reality layer a layer that resides within the crystal palace or a place that we know as heaven. A bolt of excitement starts to shiver through you. You're still shimmering slightly with your blues and your silver colors for you know that once you push past this gate you will be entering into the reality layer where your loved ones and your pets reside. The dragonfly flies towards the gates, encouraging you to walk forward. You are completely safe. You are completely loved. And you are completely full of excitement knowing that you will be seeing someone that you love, or someone that acts as your guardian angel, someone that looks over you, and will love you for eternity. You walk forward and you don't even have to push the gate as the left hand gate starts to slowly open, welcoming you into this wonderful space. And as you walk through past the gate, the dragonfly remains by the gate, wishing you well. It feels fresher as you walk through this gate, it feels more like reality. You find yourself standing on this beautiful white road, again the same colour as the wall, glinting with whites 
and silvers, like pure white crystal, it's cool below your feet. And as you look to your left and right, you find yourself in a beautifully kept, beautifully maintained street with houses to your left and right, all different shapes and sizes. You're aware that you can hear children playing somewhere. You're aware that you can hear dogs barking in another space. You start to walk along this road and this is when your loved ones will draw you to wherever you need to go to meet them. Continue to walk forward feeling the coolness of this beautiful crystal below your feet, knowing that at some stage one of your loved ones will come to get you. It's just a matter of time. Slowly walk forward. Close your eyes. Allow your soul to visualize your eyes closed, knowing that the next time that you open them, when you're in the reality layer, you will be looking at someone that you love and miss. Go forward with strength and love and enjoy this connection with your loved one.
wherever you may be, whoever you may be with, it's time now for you to say goodbye. But this isn't a goodbye forever, for you can come back here and be with your loved ones as much as you want. Allow them to give you the last final hug, the last final kiss. Please don't feel sad, feel happy, for you now know that you can visit this place as many times as you wish. You now turn yourself around feeling happy, complete, fulfilled, completely at peace. And as you turn around, you can see that familiar white crystal path right in front of you. And as you start to walk forward, feeling the love behind you from all of your loved ones, you notice that the path then opens up to a road the cool crystalline surface that your feet touch is still just as wonderfully cool and comforting as it was before. And as you walk along this path, you feel stronger. You feel more able to deal with the fact that you may physically be disconnected from your loved ones. They're always with you and you can always go to see them. You feel blissful. You feel so at peace and tranquil. You're watching your feet tread along this beautiful, shiny, white, glistening path. Feeling thankful and so happy for the experience that you've just had. You then look up and in front of you, you can see a huge white door. Colossal. However, there is a bright silver handle within reach. You walk up to this door and this door will bring you to a completely different dimension. This dimension will take you back, back to the world as you know it. As you go to touch the handle, you can feel the coolness of it. You decide to take one last look back all you can see is a beautiful white, blue and silver mist. It is full of nothing but love for you, bringing you courage, strength, support and guidance in its wake. You turn the handle and very, very slowly this huge white door opens easier than you could possibly imagine. And as you open this door, you realize that you're looking at the room, the room where you are sitting or laying in, in meditation. You walk through the door, closing it behind you and find yourself in your room. And very slowly, you walk back to your physical body and visualize the bright, blue and silver vibrant you sitting back into your physical body. You then are aware of your physical breath slowly rhythmically going in and out. You're slowly aware of you being back in that physical body and start to wiggle your toes, move your feet slightly Wiggle your fingers. And when you become accustomed to this, you then start to move your legs just slightly, completely aware of your breath going in and out. Completely aware of you being in your physical body, back in your room, back wherever you are on this earth plane. You are feeling still relaxed and happy and at peace with yourself, 
you feel like you've perhaps reached a massive, massive leap in your grieving for your loved ones. And most of all, you feel so contented that you can carry on your day knowing, knowing that you never, ever lose your loved ones forever. And with this wonderful thought in your mind, when you are ready and only when you are ready, you slowly open your eyes. And you start to look around your surroundings. And you start to notice the colours, the physical presence of where you're at. But at the same time feeling completely relaxed, completely at one with yourself. Completely at peace. If you have that glass of water at hand, when you're ready, take a nice sip of water. And perhaps you may even want to make a note of what you've been told, what your experience was in a soul journal or a diary. Wouldn't that be wonderful to just make a note of this wonderful experience that you've had? I'd also like to point out that I have been teaching people for many, many years. And some of you may not have even been able to get to where we were today. Please don't be frustrated with yourself. Our bodies and our minds are so used to walking around the earth plane that to suddenly have to go up to a different vibration, a different frequency, a different place of consciousness can be quite a big ask. And so as they say, practice makes perfect. So all it will take is for you to spend some time of self-love. Allow yourself to just take yourself into a little room somewhere. Switch this back on and allow me to take you there again. And eventually your frequency, your soul will recognize where it needs to be, where it needs to go. And you will find yourself there. So now then, let's stand up and shake ourselves about. Let's allow ourselves to realize we're back in a happy home, in a happy body. And if you are feeling that you have um, felt perhaps a bit too emotional on this journey, as again, I do say, if you feel you're not ready, please look at my other meditations on here. That will help you and bring you comfort and support until you're ready to actually face this particular one. It just leaves me to say, well done. Well done you for allowing yourselves to be taken to a beautiful place and for you to be united with people perhaps you haven't seen for a while. Thank you for joining me on this meditation and I truly look forward to sharing another adventure and journey with you very soon. God bless.